All right, you guys, I'm gonna do a quick in-depth video here on your advanced driver display, full digital display in a 2020 or 2021 Hyundai Palisade Ultimate Edition. So this does give you the full digital gauge. Um, sorry for any reflection, it is bright and this is what's happening. So uh, first screen comes up, you can just see it's uh, just a vehicle and you can see the lines on the road. And what that is, is that's your lane departure system. So if I turn it off, uh, it's gonna look a little different. You can see now it's not saying it sees the lines and that button, just so you know, is just down here. So we press this one right there and that'll turn on or off our lane departure system so now to control what's going on in the display you use these menu buttons or you toggle this up or down or press ok so i'm just going to hit the menu button it's going to bring me over to the next menu which is our gps essentially that is our compass or if we have navigation it will display in there um, I'm going to press it again and this brings us to our main menu um, so this shows us when we toggle down fuel economy drive information um, since refueling accumulated information attention level so this means I've got the vehicle running for seven minutes you can see I have a high attention as we're running longer and longer it's gonna let me know maybe I should take a break I've got a lower attention level now um, tire pressure these units will uh, show once you're driving as it wants the tires to be at running temperature not cold pressure and then down once more this is drive mode so what this means is this is what you have for your uh, settings of your um, economy or performance settings as well as your terrain settings for like snow mud or sand where you control that is right down here so when I have it in drive mode I can turn this to the left and go through these different settings if I press terrain we can go through snow, mud, or sand. Again, so I show you up here, as I move this to the side, we can be in eco, we can be in sport, or we can be in smart, and I love the animation on here. They have done such a wicked job with this. And then if I press terrain, then when I move it over, it'll show us if we're in snow, if we're in mud, or if we're in sand. Um, that is how that works. So. Uh, we press down again so this is going to show us what our wheels are doing um, as well as the all-wheel drive system as you're running so when you're driving you'll see this light up front or back um, down one more what the rpms are at so 800 rpms digitally and then down one more this is where we can select contents so if we press ok and hold it down uh, just in here now it's going to let me decide which one of these boxes is checked if I want any of the menus turned off I have them all turned on right now um, so what you'll see is if we go back to this main menu with the vehicle here uh, on the side here again we can go through any of those menus that I was just showing you and we can have that display the whole time we're driving um, we also have a digital speedometer over here so we have analog and digital going our digital fuel and the distance to empty what gear we're in if the lane departure system is on outside temperature uh, rpms um, whether a vehicle is cold or warm um, and then what we want to see inside of here now we can also hit the cruise control button if we hit that right there I press cruise this is going to turn on the smart cruise control system um, when I'm going if I turn it on um, we can select different distances to follow the vehicle in front of us there so hopefully that helps gives you a little idea of this advanced driver display uh, the last thing I just want to tell you about is if you signal um, you'll see if I signal left it'll turn on my left video camera on the mirror and show me my blind spot and if I signal right it will do the same thing uh, pretty cool all right Hope you guys enjoyed that advanced driver display video. Thanks a lot.